Welcome back. It's still Wake Up Nigeria. Now, with us, we have the one and only Brian Okwara. He's an award-winning actor. He's a social media influencer and so much more. Uh, there was a particular award that uh, a lot of people, you know, can't forget. The fact that he won the title of Mr. Nigeria. What year was that? 2008? 2007. And seven. 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 Late 2007. Wow. Okay, so we at Wake Up Nigeria have been trying to get a hold of you for a long time. I know. I'm, I'm a busy man, I know. You Re know. Really busy? So, busy doing what? <laughs> <laughs> Give us a breakdown of the day in the life of Brian. Well, uh, if, if I'm not working as an actor, uh, I am working as a, as a brand ambassador. If I'm not working as a brand ambassador, I am working as a peace ambassador. If I'm not working as a peace ambassador, I'm working as a title holder of the first Miss Nigeria, doing okay. you know charity work. Okay. If I'm not doing that, I'm just doing my international philandra travels and, and philandra. <laughs> That's not a word you use on breakfast TV. <laughs> I'm but, philandra. Okay, but, but I, I have noted that you, on, at least on social media, there's a lot of fashion involved in your lifestyle. Yes. Right. Was that deliberate, or it just happened that fashion designers just kept going up to you and and asking? Well. First of all, I think I fluked a lot of things in the beginning. You know how it is when you're trying to uh, build a brand for yourself. You see yourself in a particular image. So I think they picked up on that and they noticed that ah, Brian looks good in you know, suits and corporate wear. So okay. they just yeah. they snatched me one, one after the other. Okay. You know? And it's been a great experience so far for me. All right. So mm. a lot of people don't know that you also have a, a production company. Oh, right? really? Yes, oh, wow. uh, I, I saw it online, Guys. Fury, Fury Productions, Yes. right? So I'm thinking about how, you know, you went from model to actor to, you know, someone with a production company. How did that happen? Well, it's, it's, it's growth, man. You just have to grow. And, you know, the, the more you get exposed, the more your, your future kind of plans out mm. and uh, your plans become more visible and more attainable. So, you know, I went ahead to you know, with my people, mm. you know, to, to register a production company and we've been working on the ground. Yeah. But now we've come out with our very first production and it's doing, it's doing pretty well. Pretty All good. right then. So we're definitely going to talk about that production, but I want to take you back. <laughs> really, I, I had a plan to get some old pictures of you <laughs> and put them on the screen uh, because Throwback a, Thursday. Lot of people, a lot of people know that I was a model when I was a lot younger. Mm. And uh, we did have quite a few opportunities to model. Of together, course, yes. Among other so things. So many, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so the modeling part, mm. um, how did that start? How did that start? Mm. Well, um, <clears throat> I remember when I was a youngin and I used to go for castings. Mm. And everybody said, ah, look at this, you're a fine boy, go into modeling, you know. And I thought it was that easy at first. So I was like, ah, sure, it's, I mean, no biggie. Yeah. So I started going for castings and for like the first, what? Two years, mm -hmm. you know, nothing happened. No jobs. No jobs. Okay. You know, that's why when I look at people that come up to me now and say, ah, Brian, you know, you had it easy. You're like, ah, Baba, can I be like you? I'm like, if you're willing to put everything and then maybe your first two years not get one job yeah. and later start to, and later things start to fall into place for you, then you're in the right track. But if you feel you've done this, ah, Baba, I've done this for nine months. Nothing's happening, man. Nine How months. you take Duam? I'm like, <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you get what I'm trying to say? So, you know, it's, it was pretty much just putting in the work. Mm. And I, I, I guess I did. I guess I did that. Okay, so I'm going to take that word work mm. and add the word out. Mm. Work out. Oh, shit? Yeah. I want to do that. <laughs> Why? Because I remember back in the day, you were one skinny model. Skinny, tall, fair boy. Like, really. <laughs> I can do this. I'm dead. Because I know. <laughs> so how did the workout thing start? There are some pictures of you online, mm. shirtless. Oh, wow. Like. They have that on there? Yeah you, yeah, you posted them. Wow. I mean, I wouldn't Google myself. So, uh, I mean, I don't know what's wow. on there. <laughs> I don't know what's on there. So, okay. how did the workout and fitness aspect of your lifestyle start? So, you want the real story or you want the made-up story? Because uh, you know, everyone has, like, a superhero story attached to them. Like, yeah, the you know, real story. Because, you know, this, there was, I, was, I was walking. I was just walking one day, going for yeah. a casting, and then... This meteor just hit Nigeria, okay. somewhere around Oweri. Okay. And I was like, wow. Okay. So I went to touch it, and then I just grew big muscles. and strong, and muscles just... All right. Okay, so that's a fake story. Okay. So the real story now is, I, I've been working out, man. Okay. You know, uh, it got to a part in my life where I wanted to 
go international. I mean, as you know, I modeled international for what, four or five years? Mm -hmm. So I wanted to go international and they told me, this physique is not gonna work. You need to, okay. you know, you look better in clothes. You need to have an appeal, a certain appeal. So I was looking up to that appeal and I was working out to, to those goals. Yeah. And um, I mean, I, I fear myself then because I worked out like eight times in, in what? Eight times in seven days. How, how That's how not does possible, that work? right? No, exactly. So I worked out every day. Okay. And I gave it all. And you know, that's that's pretty much how I grounded myself to get here. Okay. So I mean everything that I attained until now didn't just come free, didn't just come because I started eating better or anything. No. It's because at a point in time I gave it my all. All you right. Know? Yeah. Okay. So so now let's go back to the production company. Okay. And um, obviously once you have been called a fine boy from very young you work out. <coughs> International farm boy. <coughs> yeah, then you, you get all the designers giving you really nice clothes to wear. Obviously, what comes next is the ladies. So, uh, this campaign We're not here so to talk about Rihanna, right? Like, that wasn't real. Rihanna. Okay. Rihanna? That was, that was I wanted to say something in Pigeon. I'm holding myself back. Thunder. <laughs> Does it start with thunder? No. Fire? Fire? No, okay. no. All right. no. But thunder, fire. You, <laughs> you said it. But really, um, the campaign says, win a date with Brian. Yeah. And I'm like, why? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I said. Why? Ah. But it seems to be really catching on. And yes. people are really getting involved. So you yes. want to talk a bit about that? OK, win a date with Brian, you know, has been a long time project that we started. Uh, it's not, I mean, people say win a date with Brian. Ah. This guy wants to marry Abi. Wants to guy. No, but it's, it's, that's not what it is. It's not. It's not a matchmaking uh, thing. It's 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 one lucky girl who wins the date. Okay. You know, to come, to experience the world with me. You know, to it's pretty much based on the experience. Okay. And then th there's money on the side. You know, yeah. she, she gets to win two million naira. The two two million. Yeah, naira? two million naira cash prize. You know, okay. we're, we're giving that to to to, to start our up. Okay. Like a bumper start to say, wow. okay, you know what? This this is what you get <laughs> for winning. Million. Yeah, she wins two million naira. Cash. Cash, yeah. Oh wow. Okay. And so, what's the date gonna? What's happening on this date? What's happening on the date is she's gonna come to Dubai with me. Okay. On an experience of a lifetime. I mean, it's five days of tourism in Dubai. We're gonna do everything. You okay. know, from skydiving to jet skiing. You know, we're gonna do everything that Dubai has. So, and um, I mean put so much in this we're going to film everything of course. of course we put so much in this and we want to bring it back and you know have a great show you know so it's more about the experience you know your feedback you know what you think you know and how it is how i mean how cool i am you know to be on the day with wow. Brian, that kind of thing okay so it's not like a the bachelor kind of concept mm -mm -mm. so you're not going to be handing out roses and you know having a top 10. And no, we're going to have a dinner of course okay eventually like a you top 10 what collection of f hot women what? no it's just no. one winner it's just okay. one winner okay and that one winner will come on a trip of a lifetime oh. and an experience of a lifetime with i mean i'm hoping i'm a celebrity crush but you know <laughs> with you know i'm just vying for that post but wish with, with me yeah you know and um we're gonna have we're gonna have a blast you know okay so how do people get involved we have like 30 seconds to talk about that. Okay, how do people get involved? They have to send a text okay. uh, to a short code. Am I, am I allowed to? to? Uh, well, your social media handle is enough. Yes. At Brian O'Quara, O'Quara, right? On all platforms at Brian O'Quara. So there's some food that the chef has been putting together for quite a while. And uh, your me hopefully hasn't finished that food. So you hungry? I, don't, I thought you're not. No, I mean, so I don't know about you. I'm going to leave you right here. I'm going to go and eat plantain. No, since you're handling the show, let me leave you. Okay. <laughs> All right, no, but seriously. So you can sign out. Let's go. Let's go to the kitchen. Oh, you never right. ask. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. All right. Okay. Hey, people. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? How you doing? Uh, Good this green is. Please see. have a seat over here. He didn't get to me. Or... <laughs> <laughs> Please have a seat over here. Oh, this is me? This is me? Yes, that's you. Now, this yeah. is Chef Susan. Hi. Hi. She, she heard you were coming. Oh. And she, <laughs> she made this with love. Oh. Whoa. Hi. So she's wow. a top contender for the two million. <laughs> yes. Wow. wow. Okay. Tell me what you're doing. Please, please, please. please. <laughs> are, the picture, picture. are we getting photographs of, please, please. of this love moment right now? Thanks, thanks, for, thanks for making this. All I mean, right. Yeah. So just tell us, uh, Chef Susan, tell us what you did here. I helped out. Okay. <laughs> by the way. Yes, you did. And I cleaned up. 
nicely. Mike said, <laughs> Mike said he's going to be a good husband material. No, but uh, guys, you, you know I like food, right? Like, this, this is me. Like, yeah. right now we're in my office. You guys think this is your show? <laughs> but this just became my show. So All right. I, I can Brian. tell you what's on that plate. Okay, okay, tell me. Tell us. Okay, so there's a very nice setting, very, very well garnished jello fries yeah. okay. with some broccoli on it that oh. I can see, some very nice oh. broccoli. Is that, what is that, is that fish? Yes, yes. That's, fish. that's fish. Fish, fish. Croca yeah. fish. Croca fish. Yeah. fish with mm -hmm. some yes. tomatoes, some onions. Mm -hmm. I see, mm -hmm. I see you nice, know a lot. I see nice golden, <laughs> go, well, well fried golden plantains on the Ooh. side. Okay. <laughs> oh shit. Yes. And I even know this for, is. <laughs> Oh, wow. yeah. <laughs> okay. It's not made in China, guys. These guys, they put a lot of effort. All right. So, see TVC. So, <laughs> let's, let's, let's let me just well say over. that it's uh, coconut jello fries. Yes. Right. Oh, wow. Okay. That's what we made. Mm -hmm. and, and the plantain itself is air fried, so it's very, very healthy. Yes. Yeah. Way. So, yes. That's the thing? Yes, yeah, of course. Way. Please, yes. have a taste. Have a taste. Mm -hmm. Start from anywhere. Yeah. Have a taste. Yeah, yes. have a taste say, first. Say, guy. Lem, <laughs> food is ready. Okay. Oh, look at Brian, that. looks so good on the screen. Yes, looks good. Looks good. <laughs> Brian, Lem, oh, you have a taste. Yeah, you guys, you guys, why are you guys doing this? It's been stuff? a fun day, but my stomach is rumbling, so I hope you kept some for, for yeah, us. Of course, okay. Okay. I'm just checking, you know, yeah. <laughs> so we don't have to bring out our boxing gloves. Yeah, yeah. But it's, <laughs> all, <laughs> it's all about having a fun show on Wake Up Nigeria. Hopefully, you've had loads of fun too. Yes, we have. Big thank you to our friends over at Homely NG always for the kitchen accessories here on the show. And of course, a big shout out to Fola at Fola's Place for the hairstyling. We appreciate you. Much love. Uh, so what's up with this food? No, I'm, I'm tasting it now. You're tasting? Yes, you're tasting. Yeah. Yeah. Taste. They said have a taste. I'm have a having taste. it. Um, please, allow me to have my taste. Okay. okay. So yeah. tell us about the first few tastes you've had. <laughs> See, what? when I finish it there, yeah. I'll have so much to tell. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Chef Susan. Thank well I think you. this is Thank great. You. I think this is great. I mean, Thank the food tastes mind. nice. Yes. And I love a lot of peppers, and the pepper is right. Uh -huh. I mean, yeah, this, this, is, this is my meal this uh, morning. Okay. I don't know what you guys feel. Good. Okay. It's, it's all yours. Thank don't you. Worry, Mike. All right, people. <laughs> we'll be back for the Friday edition of Wake Up Nigeria on the show. Don't forget, 7 a.m., yes, same time. And if you missed anything, check us out online. Use our hashtag, Wake Up Nigeria. It'll all be right there. Yeah, say bye-bye, everybody. Bye! bye. bye.